So I just got done watching a video by VaneWPC, a um, little shout out, and I just uh, wanted to do the 10 nail polishes tag, and so I'm just going to, I'm not going to do the red, yellow, orange one because A, I don't have yellow or orange, um, so I'm just going to show you some of my very favorite nail polishes. I think I have it down to 10 uh, or 11, maybe even 12, so let's just do it. Um, I know that these three are actually from last summer, um, but I really loved them at the time, and I just think they're so pretty, and a lot of people have had them, I think, turquoise and Caicos. It's kind of a um, greenish blue, and then L Lapis of Luxury. It's really pretty. It's an actual like lapis color, kind of bluish. And then uh, Mint Candy Apple, which I know a lot of people had, um, and it is a very, very light minty green. Very, very pretty. I don't know if you can see the color better on that way. Then, that day that I bought those, um, I was at Ulta, and they were having kind of like a buy three, get one free, I think it was. And so I dashed back to the Essie counter and was just, you know, looking for something. And this one grabbed my eye, and I don't know why, but it turns out it looks really, really pretty on. And it's called over the knee and it's um hard to describe it's kind of like a brown ish pink with like almost like a copper shimmer but that barely barely shows up it is really pretty on the toes very pretty on the toes and then this i also got um this is also se oh by the way obviously those are all se products and then this one um is a just a very very neutral color it's called allure and you know one layer of it you really can't tell that it's a color your nails just look really healthy and pretty um so i really like this color a lot and i use this often when i just have a moment and just need to make my nails look kind of shiny and healthy a lot of times i'll use this one these two are just reds, but I think they're really, really pretty. The first one I love to use during the holidays because it's just got a lot of sparkle and it's very, very pretty. And it is called, it's um, one of the OPI by Sephora, or it's actually Sephora by OPI. And this one is called Sample Sale. And it's a red, but it's very, very uh, Christmassy colored and very sort of shiny. It's got a lot of glitter in it. Not big, chunky, nasty glitter, but just a really pretty shimmery color for the holidays. And this one is OPI, and it's called Red Red Rhine, and it's a much darker red, and I love this for the winter and the fall, just sort of a deep blood red, and I love that color. This one I only wear on my toes, and I don't wear very often because... Um, it's just pretty much pretty out there, but it is a Sally Hanston Insta Dry Fast Dry Nail Color, and it is in the color 25 Grape Going, <laughs> which is kind of silly, but it is an iridescent blue purple color, and um, it really is very unique. A couple of people commented on it when I wore it. When it catches the light, it's just um, almost three dimensional. It's very very cool. And this one I like a lot because of the name and because it's just a cool looking nail polish, but it really only goes on as a top coat over something else. If you put it on just by itself, it's very, very sheer and it just um, doesn't look very good. It almost looks like um, it's kind of a blue with sparkles in it. Um, but if you put it over black or a really dark uh, purple color, um, then the sparkles and the sheen really come out. And it's got, again, like a pinky copper sheen to it. Um, and it's the Orly. And it's Space Cadet. And again, it's got like a blue undertone to it. And then like kind of a copper sheen to it. And um, definitely very, very glittery. So I love this on my toes occasionally. And then the last color I have is another Essie. And it's called Velvet Voyeur. And it's a very dark purple color. Very, very dark purple absolutely love 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 during the winter almost black you know it could, could be mistaken for black but um, it's just really gorgeous and then my very last one is just plain old um, Essie but this is the three-way glaze and it's a base coat and a top coat and 
I don't know what else. A ridge filler, maybe? Anyway, all you need is this, and I really, really like it. So that's it. Um, just wanted to do that video. Sounded like fun. I hope you enjoyed watching that, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.